and welcome to your favorite channel for all things Roblox, Bloxy Banner. I hope you're having a great day, and for this video, we're gonna talk about how Inquisitor Master says she's angry that Gabby uninvited her to her wedding. But before we get into today's topic, I want you to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And comment on which squad member is your favorite. But with further interruption, let's get right into this one. Drake and Gabby are getting married. As we all know, we'd anticipated them inviting all of their pals, but then something unexpected happened. Gabby got Alex's name removed from their guest list. Since the beginning, we've been rooting for these two. We've always assumed they were meant to be together. After all, their personalities are similar. Gabby has a reputation for being a competitive, loud, and opinionated individual. On a daily basis, she enjoys mocking the other members and humorously rants at Zack. Gabby is a sassy, tomboyish, confident, bright, unpleasant, and outspoken young woman now. Gabby's also a lot calmer on the Z Squad. Drake, on the other hand, is portrayed as bold, silent, astute, and fascinating of a figure. He's believed to virtually always cheat with the squad during hide and seek, and he occasionally abandons others with Zack. Drake may be hilarious at times, such as when he mocks his bandmates, who also make other members chuckle by snitching on them. He also spends the majority of videos silent, hinting that he's bashful or dislikes communicating. They also have a lot of history in common. Drake and Gabby both made their debuts when the squad was still in its infancy. Fans began to ship Drake and Gabby because Alex and Zack were already together and had built a good bond. Drake and Gabby are engaged as of 2021. Reese and Gabby, as well as Drake and Gabby, were seen in real life in one of the videos released just before the premiere of the squad. Because they were shooting photos with Trum Trum hackers, many fans imagined they were dating. Drake and Gabby had a lot of numerous encounters in early 2020. Gabby's pretended to be pregnant multiple times. Drake died merely to avoid being chased by Gabby. And Drake has attempted to prevent Zack from shooting Gabby despite Zack standing as Sheriff. Gabby prefers to interact with Zack since they have similar personality features. Or Alex and Charlie because despite their romantic jokes, they're all of the same gender. Even though it wasn't steamy as Zaylix's, Drake and Gabby had a fascinating relationship during Zack's absence in November and early December. They were given extra attention. Drake and Gabby gained even more attention than before because Zack was no longer taking up the majority of the screen time. In Among Us, Drake and Gabby had an impromptu makeout and spent a lot of time together, just like Gabby and Alex. Zack also revealed that Gabby was dating Drake and still is, according to the truth or dare about Zack and Urza dating in Roblox. You now see why Alex was not invited to her wedding. We understand why Alex got kicked out despite the fact that she wasn't the one who brought the two closer together. It's such an easy thing. We're surprised we didn't see it earlier. She doesn't want to be the one to sabotage their special day. But how did Alex respond? Alex exhibited a strong feeling of self-importance, which was well known to many people at the time. Alex repeatedly referred to the other members of the group as bullies and idiots in her videos despite previously claiming that doing so would damage her public image and reputation. The other members have also characterized Alec as dumb, despite the fact that she stated that she has no malevolent intent. She's also the center of attention, receiving excessive praise from the majority of the other members, despite the fact that she may not deserve it in the first place. This was placed on the internet so that everyone could view it. I remember Alex picking on me and calling me fat, and she used to make jokes about what I ate. Despite my sympathy for her, I did not act in a hostile manner towards her. She acquired confidence as a result of her inability to answer. She had a small group of psychophants who, once she acquired their trust, began to assist her in her objectives. As though they succeeded in convincing me that I was 
the rotund Robloxian, while she was the polar opposite. To say the least, Roblox's psychology is weird. And that's all we have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, then be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Roblox content like this and much, much more. We'll see you guys in the next time. Until then, take care and make sure to stay hydrated. Bye, everyone.